Less than 24 hours after fire swept through more than 100 shops here at French Line, some victims have started re-erecting the burnt structures. For them, life must return to normalcy, regardless of the huge losses they've incurred. All of us are eager to start our work. As you know, we are heading towards the Christmas, so we need to start our work, uh, business. That's why you see people are doing, we are really doing. Anytime that was the, the, there was a disaster, we have to do our own rebuilding. Okay. There is no any assistance whatsoever that is coming from the authority. So definitely, we have to do our own rebuilding. That's why we started it. Some affected traders scavenge through the debris to see whether they may be lucky enough to recover some of their items, including money. For many here, they are thinking of how to return to business after losing almost everything. The damage is unquantifiable and most of the traders are seeking a helping hand to bounce back to business. I'm a phone repeller. At the same time, I'm selling screens and both screen guide. So I've lost everything. I've lost everything, including my money. We are waiting for the authority to come to our aid and help us because we don't know what to do. Because a lot of us here, we are working with a loan. Some have collect money from bank and they are doing their businesses. And today that this is a sad news that we are in. So we are appealing for authority to come to our aid and help us. Investigations to establish the exact cause of the fire has commenced by the Ghana National Fire Service. But preliminary reports point to electrical faults. Ibrahim Abubakar, TV3 News, French Line, Kumasi.